well guys that was pretty sad to me you know yeah some viewers you know reach out and try to help people and then uh basically you know basically kind of get shunned about it you know just take it as though it was you know means nothing but you know ah uh, man it's hard to say i guess i uh i'm less than impressed with uh you know the response i got today a little disturbing but hey life goes on let's uh let's keep our eyes on the prize and focus on some uh you know some bigger and better things but who knows all right man thanks for tuning in wait to see what happened how you doing young jay what are you grazing on it looks like a burrito or something it looks pretty tasty <laughs> Oh, nice. Need a cold watermelon? Yeah, sure. Appreciate it. You want a watermelon? Oh, no. I'm going to just drink this normal today. Normal? Well, I've been out of commission here the last couple days. Well, not yesterday. I came by and uh, didn't see much. You know, it's all timing, you know, when I can get around versus when you guys are actually here. And, uh, have you given any further thought on that offer from that family in Texas? I know you don't know them from a you know blade of grass, but yeah. I can put you in contact with them, and uh, you guys can talk about it. You know, do all you know, sort things out. You know, worst case scenario, you can always come back. You know, in my opinion, that would be entirely up to you, young man. You know. I was really still thinking about it. Well, it's, like you said, it's a lot to take in at one time. Sure. It's just like, yeah, it's a decision not to be made lightly, you know. Yeah. Well, do you feel that? Especially at my age, I'm so young, you know. Well, that's the idea. I life ahead of me. Yeah. How do I know this is the right decision? Well, I would contradict that with saying, how do you know it's not the right decision? Is what you're doing now working? Do you want to be out here? I'm not really, I'm not exactly sad. Well, you seemed like it the other day. I was yep. pretty worried about you, but you know, day. yeah, days are different, you know, I get it. That's another book bag. Man, you go through the backpacks. Yeah, I got rid of the blue and it was too small. Yeah. Well, all right. Uh, basically, just kind of checking in. It looks like you just had lunch. Yeah. You know. So you're uh, making sure you don't get cold or anything in this 101 degree weather. <laughs> With your <laughs> fleece Reebok jacket on. Yeah. I gotta have my jacket on. It's important. Don't you get hot? I stand on the island with this jacket on. Huh? Whatever it works, I guess. All right. Use as a shade mechanism so I won't burn my neck. Oh, that works. Yeah. All right. Well, I'll leave you to it. You know. Okay. Not, hi. hi. Would you like a water, young lady? Uh, sure, thank you. Yeah. I'll tell you what. I've got some uh, flavor packs that you know, some electrolyte additives, some grape and whatnot. You know, you tear them open. Black cherry, grape, or watermelon? Right. Grape. Grape. All right, let me dig one out for you. There you go. Thank you so There's much. There's a great for you. Well, be careful. God bless you. Man, you got your hands full. Yeah, I know. But I can't take that bug because I'm scared I'll be erased for you. Yeah, you don't want that. Yeah. yeah I feel like that. All right, well, you have a good day. Yeah. Man, that's horrible. What are you talking about? Well, just the situation, you know. Having to try to survive in this heat, living in a tent, you know. Laying underneath trees, hoping you don't get robbed. You know, I don't know. Now you're a young dude, man. Like you said, you got your whole life ahead of you. 
but I guess I would look at it this way. If you don't see much change happening here, it doesn't make a ton of sense to stay. But at the same time, you know, you're a grown man. You know, you can make your own decisions. Well, I'm not pushing you to do anything. You, know, you do what you, you can just decide to do what you please. You know, like I said, you're you know you're an adult. You know you, you've been around the block a little bit here and there, but I just don't know why the opposition to change would be so uh, detrimental to your situation as we speak. But you know, either way, no, that's cool. Um, I got their phone number, but it's at home. I didn't hear from you, so um, you know I wasn't yeah, sure if it was. I lost the car, though. Yeah. Yeah. I'll give you another one. Okay. Well, you know you got the backpack and and the whole nine yards, so I guess uh, holding on to a card if it's that difficult. Yeah, you know, I'm not sure what else I could tell you. Yeah. Why do you want me to call you? You don't have to do anything you don't want to do, man. Yeah. If you get in a situation or a pinch, you know. Have you felt I've helped you at all? In any way, shape, or form? You give me water. Just wow. Okay. All right. Well. You did. What do you want me to say? I'm talking about since I met you. Yeah. All right. So what's all the grief about? Why would you want me to call you? I don't know. If you decide to change your mind and you might want to get out of town and start a fresh thing, I'm not pushing you to do anything you don't want to do. It's plain and simple. It's up to you. Go. Don't go. Stay here. You know, if you don't see anything changing, you know, I see you got a ton of family support. And, uh, you know, that ain't working. But... I'm not. I'm just. I'm going. I'm repeating what you've told me. Well, is that or is that? Have I said anything that's not factual? You gotta be sarcastic about it. Though. No, I'm just asking you a question. Is anything I said not factual? Yeah, you say. I see you've got a ton of family support. I obviously don't. So that's being sarcastic. No, that's that's, that's being factual. That's non-factual. You say I see you've got a lot of family support. I don't. So that's non-factual. No, man. That's Sounds stupid. Fuck out my face with this camera, bro. Like, All right. Well, have a good one. Try to help the man out, and that's what you get. Some people don't want help. Some people need help. Don't want to ask. Don't ask, don't tell type of thing. His decision, man. Grown adult. And, uh, yeah. Either way you look at it, you know, sad situation. But, uh, you know, I'm just a messenger. You know, I deliver some, uh, you know, gifts and different things that people send, you know, to certain individuals, depending on if, you know, how they like, you know, perhaps in the videos. But, you know, you can't help everybody. You can lead them. <laughs> The old saying goes, I guess, you can lead the horse to the water, but you can't make him drink. But, uh, no, that's cool. I wasn't trying to be sarcastic. Sometimes maybe it sounds like that, but, you know, the facts are the facts. So, you know, either way. All right, we're going to sign off, guys. Going to see what else we can do today. It's toasty. It's 101 uh, heat index. Supposed to go up to 106. It's only 2 o'clock. So... Five o'clock or so is about the hottest time of the day in my neck of the woods. So we're gonna see what we can do here. A lot of people are just hiding out, you know, keeping shaded areas and, you know, as little amounts of sunlight that they can possibly tolerate. But uh, with that being said, cool. All right, I'll be back, guaranteed. <laughs>